Hey, hello guys, welcome back. In this video, I will be talking about one of the most important interview question of Python. So the question is count the frequency of element in a list. So if you can see, we have this input list and here we have this one, two, three, four, five, again five and again two and three. Then you can see we have to, uh, you know, get the output like, you know, count the frequency of each element. Like, you know, we have one, one comes here one time two comes here two times right three comes here two times four comes here one time and five comes here two times right so actually in python we have a we have a method called counter okay we can you know we can directly call this uh, call this sub collection library or module and we can do the uh, need needful thing but there is another way what by which we can you know achieve the same solution so let's see how we can do so i will create a function let's say counter and here i will pass a one list okay and here what i'll do i'll create one dictionary let's say fic frequency okay so by default the frequency is empty you know? right now what i am doing here um, i'll iterate a loop so what i am doing for i in this list you know which i am passing over here right and then what i am doing i am i am writing this fake of i okay i am inserting this element i right and i am checking fig dot get i if it is present if it is not present then give return zero and plus one okay and uh, what i'll do just for you you know just to show you i will try to print this fig of i as well as i also here correct and here i will just write return uh, return fig fig right i guess yes fig correct we are returning here uh, dictionary correct now what i'll do i'll quickly go here and print not print i'll just call this method uh, and with this elements cool now try to run this then you can see we have this output like see first one one comes over here okay one goes over here so one is repeated one like one is present and it it returns one okay then two two goes here likewise three goes here four goes here and then five goes here so till five you can see we have one one value right but again when five comes over here it returns a value right see since five is already present over over in this dictionary so it returns one one plus one returns one plus one returns two two right so that's why here we can see two likewise if if two goes here then it checks whether two two has an entry or not two has an entry already and the value is what value is one so it returns two likewise for three also it returns two and this is my output right okay so let me remove this line because that's not needed and let me give uh, another example let's say you know if i am passing two three one three four five ten eleven eleven two let's see if i run this then what will happen now you can see we have uh, we have a output output like this two four one one three three four and so on so on so if you want to you know uh, now the interviewer can can uh, twist this problem and he will say that you know you have to you have to sort this key also so you you have to sort this uh, dictionary by the key or maybe by the value so you have to sort this with the help of uh, key okay with the help of key like you know one should place here then two then three then four five and then ten eleven right so you can also think of this solution and write down this solution and give me give me answer in your comment box okay so i hope that you have understood this this, this logic or this questions and we will we will talk in the next video till then bye bye thank you